Carlos Alcaraz versus Alexander Zverev is the second quarterfinal for the Indian Wells tournament for the men for 2024. And both have had different roads to get to this stage. Zverev entered the tournament as a number six seed, and we get a bye in the first round. In the second round, he take on O'Connell. There's no problem getting through in straights. 6-4, 6-4. In the third round, he take on Grigspor, the 27th seed. And after a close first set, saving set points, Zverev would come back to win 7-6, 6-3. In the fourth round, he take on the number 10 seed, Demonor, a man that he'd lost to at the start of the season at the United Cup. And after dropping the first set, he would fight back to win 5-7, 6-2, 6-3 to advance to the quarterfinals. Alcaraz entered the tournament as the number two seed and would get a bye in the first round. In the second round, he take on the Italian Arnaldi and after dropping the first set, he would fight back to win 6-7, 6 love, 6-1. In the third round, he take on the 31st seed, Ojali Asim, a man that he'd lost to a few times previously. This is no problem for Alcaraz getting through in straights, 6-2, 6-3. In the fourth round, he take on Marajan, the man that upset him in Rome on the clay courts of last year. But there was no repeat with Alcaraz getting through in straights, 6-3, 6-3 to advance to the quarterfinals. These guys have played eight times before with Zverev leading the head-to-head 5-3, including winning their last two matches, one of the ATP finals last year, and also the Australian Open this year in the quarterfinals. So Zverev has really got his like his chances on the hard courts at Indian Wells. If Zverev's going to win this one, he needs to serve big, and he needs to figure out that forehand. His forehand was so bad against Dimonor, he just kept missing everything on that side. So he needs to figure that out real quick because he's not going to get as many free points as he did against Alcaraz as he did against Dimonor. If Alcaraz is going to win this one, he needs to get that serve working as he's been doing all week. His serve has been really, really strong and also bring that variety. He's got to try and figure out as well how to beat Zverev on a hard court because the last time he did beat him on a hard court, Zverev was coming off a five set, like five set epic. So he needs to really figure out how to beat Zverev, a fresh Zverev as well, on a hard court if he's going to get through this one. Very fun matchup. Love to see these guys play. Um, it was a great match in Australia. It was a great match at the end of last year. But I'm going to go with Alcaraz in three sets. I think that Indian Wells, being the defending champion, I reckon he might be able to figure it out. Maybe Zverev's serve is a little bit off. And also the game wasn't great against Dimonor. So if it's the same Zverev, Alcaraz should wrap this one up in three. But let me know in the comments below. Who do you think is making the semis?